individuals can participate in the network? For example, will there be a way to earn with the Spark token? Absolutely. So uh, sort of low risk or zero risk really way of uh, obviously unless you, you mess up how you do it. Uh, 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 pretty much there's no there's no risk to uh, participating in the Oracle system. There's no mm -hmm. slashing. It, there's no it's not asking you for money. It doesn't ask you to send your token anywhere. So uh, we hope that many wallets and many exchanges will um, uh, essentially integrate with the uh, Oracle system to allow people to uh, essentially delegate the votes that are attached to their tokens mm. uh, to whichever Oracle providers or whichever data providers they wish to uh, delegate to. Um, that's something we have had many conversations with people about. It's something we are pushing. It's something that some of our hardware wallets that are listed on our page already uh, specify, and it's it's something we're talking to exchanges about actively. So uh, that's really the first way for people to um, participate. Uh, and we would expect most parties that provide those kind of delegation services, especially data providers to take a small fee, a reasonable fee, you know, 10% of anything they earn, maybe 20%. It's, it's up, to, up to them and it's up to the market. It's not something we set. Um, but that's a, that's a great way to participate and actively encourage people to participate in that. Uh, the more people that participate in that, the, the better quality the data signal will be and the yeah. more decentralized. Uh, then, of course, the, for more advanced people, they can participate as an agent. Um, they can either do that directly or they could do that um, with a, a counterparty. Um, you know, so, so if they do it directly, they are in control of that, uh, but it does require a reasonable amount of management because essentially you, it's a financial position that you have, um, or you can do it with the counterparty such an, as an exchange that offers those kind of services. So that's, uh, that's, that's, that's the participation with, with Spark. And obviously there's, there's many other uh, ways that Spark could conceivably be used, but those are the ways that we've defined in, in our white papers. And that's the, the core purpose of Spark.